Guys, welcome to another Abandonware Adventures to the original Prince of Persia from 1989 or 1990, depending on where you live. And this is probably my first video game ever, at least on the PC, at least on the PC. I think my, my house did have Pong, but, but in the Sultan's absence, the Grand Vizier Jafar rules with the iron fist of tyranny. Only one obstacle remains between Jafar and the throne, the Sultan's beautiful young daughter. The, the, the plot is Disney's Aladdin, okay? It's even Jafar, okay? Now, I haven't seen this cinematic probably since the early 90s. Now, I was born in 1989, so obviously I didn't play it in 1989, but I played it shortly after. And I never got very far. I, I never- I, I, I think it's level one? I never got past level one. Ooh, it's the bad guy. All these characters were rotoscoped, by the way. The creator, Jordan Mechner, filmed footage of people, and notably his younger brother, for the main character. And he, he pixel art over the footage so that it, it, like, all the characters moved realistically. All of that, you can find that footage on Jordan Mechner's own YouTube channel. Marry Jafar or die within the hour. All the princess's hopes now rest on the brave youth she loves. Little does she know that he is already a prisoner in Jafar's dungeon. Mm -mm -mm. Now, this game revolutionized a lot of things. Jordan Mechner, right there. Oh, don't knock the mic. Oh, there's other people involved too. Look at that. But Jordan Mechner is the man in charge. Uh, first of all, time-based gameplay. There's a one-hour time limit. Ooh, ooh, look, look at that running animation. Ooh, yes. This, this is, is this a demo or is this, I don't know. Is this a demo? We're just gonna watch this demo. It's so amazing. The jump and grab ability, the jump and grab ability started here. You know how in Tomb Raider, you had to jump and grab ledges and pull yourself up? Started here. Started, ah, oh, oh, look, okay. We're gonna start the game. But, oh, 60 minutes left. And we're gonna take our time because what I'm gonna do first, we are totally gonna die. I think arrow keys work. So shift. Oh, okay. Shift is to sneak. And then we can do the jump and grab to hold onto the ledge and pull ourselves up. Oh, fantastic. Okay. Can we jump and... Okay. I think there's only one way to go, right? Really? Do we have, like, this is the start. Do you always have to fall? Can I just, no, ah, you do you have to do that? Like, I only played this a little bit, but do you have to do that? Okay. <laughs> uh, I have to find the sword. Okay. Well, let's see. So we can duck. So we can do a little hop thing. Okay. I guess we just run around and well, we don't have a sword, so <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> uh, let's jump up here. Pull ourselves up. Okay. I guess we run and jump. Okay. Try not to fall onto that. So spacebar shows we have 58 minutes left. All right, let's go. Let's see if I can just make it further than I did back when I was a kid. No? Not that. So I can do this, okay. So I assume we don't have any other way to go. Okay, that was a bit dangerous. Climb yourself up. Okay, okay. Oh, no! Okay, <laughs> okay, <laughs> look. Uh, we're gonna die. We're, I don't think we, we can finish this game today, but we're gonna- we're just gonna try do as best as we can, okay? Okay. What- what is- Why is that floor tile different? Oh, oh okay. Okay, it's throwing stuff at me. Okay. Come back here. 
So we need to jump over that? No, 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 we're dead. Okay. <laughs> ah! So this is a one hour game, but as you can tell, you don't beat it in an hour. Press button to continue, and we know button is shift. Okay. All right, all right. So we have to start by falling down here, no choice. Then we... Is it possible to run past the swords guy? Let's find out, let's find out. Can we just, like... No, no, you cannot do that. Let's press button, okay. <laughs> All right, let, let's try that again. We, so we have to find... It, it's just it's just one shot. Okay, there we go. Do you really have to take that damage? Really? Is that the only way to, like, injure your ankles when you do that? Grab the ledge when you fall. How do you do that? How do you do that? How do you hang from the ledge? So if I... What, do I sneak up to the edge? Turn around, hold shift, press down? No? How, how do you... Oh, you hold... Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, alright. That's a thing. Uh, we need to press that button, so let's... So if I wanted to... So I turn around and hold down and I can hang from the ledge. Okay. Okay, okay. No, I just, I just... Look, look, it's, uh... It's hard, okay? <laughs> it's hard. Let, let's try not... So if I just run across here... So, if I hang from the ledge... Turn around, hold down... Ah... Ah, look at that. Learning is happening. Okay, okay. Up we go. Up we go. It's very slippery, that's why. So, you have to press jump sooner than you think. Okay, okay. So, back here. Uh, let's just jump down here. Press this button here. Jump across, climb up, and then we're here. Okay. Do not fall down here. You can't just stop moving. You have to run confidently. What does this button do? Okay, well, I don't see anything down there, so maybe... Oh, wait. Okay, we're here. We're here. So we have to jump over that button. No, damn it. Too late again. Okay, okay. Well, do you see that turning around animation? Wow, wow, okay. Okay, climb up, climb up, let's go. Okay, this is the furthest we've ever been. No, no, don't. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. So this is a button right here. I don't know what that does. Oh, there's a sword. There's a sword. Okay, so what we want to do... I think I remember finding the sword. So this is... I, I've definitely played up until here before. Okay, is that gonna fall? I think we're fine if we just run. So here's a sword. Do you just duck to pick it up? How do you... Yes, we have a sword. No idea how you fight with it. Uh, any tips on how to fight with it? I don't know. Okay, but that over there looks like something we might want to look at. How do I... Can I hang down from here? Yes, yes, okay. This must be something. He draws a sword automatically. Okay. This game has quick saves. 
No. So what's this way? That will kill me, right? You guys are saying go upstairs secrets. You know, that, that room did seem very sort of secret filled. Can I climb up here? Okay, so I can do this, right? I remember this room. Can I just jump up here? Oh, you can just do that. Okay, okay. I was looking at this just now. There's definitely something here. Ooh. Huh. You can sneak across spikes. Oh, okay. The original you died. Okay, that's health, right? If I recall correctly, that's health. Um, but I don't think I can get that, right? Look at that hanging animation. Okay, let's go down one more. Okay, I'm just so afraid of falling. Okay, so if I release shift, he releases, okay. So I assume we can sneak across spikes, really? Also, you, how do we get to that potion? Is that a max health increase? Because that will be good. That, that would be very important. No, we can't get it from there. So I could go back and fight that guy. Oh, as in, can I... Can I get up there? Is that a thing? Can I do that? Let's just sneak over. I know it's 50... We're, we're not going to make it, are we? We're just messing around too much. So if I turn around... Can I jump up here? No, I can't. No, I can't. I don't think I can. It's okay. So if I just sneak up here... Ah, damn it! Look, I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna continue on here. No, don't! Okay. So we can sneak across spikes? I hope you guys are correct. It's sneak across, not jump across, right? What are we gonna find out? <sighs> Why is this so stressful? Okay. Okay. Well, that's, that floor is gonna collapse, right? No? No, it's a dead end? Oh, come on. Okay, well... Nothing... So we have to go back and fight that guy, right? Let's just sneak past this again. Okay, okay. That's... Okay. We carelessly lost one... One health. Here we go, so we do this. Okay, I like how it does snap a little bit because the controls are very slippery. What does this open? I don't know. No, oh, come on! Oh, <laughs> Why is this so hard? This is so hard, look at him, look at him. Look, we're gonna press button. Okay, we know what we need to do. Grab the sword, rush back here. Okay, grab the sword, rush back here. Let's try not lose a life here. Turn around. Just tip down. Drop down. Okay. Okay. Jump up here. We're running across this. Okay, okay. So we need... To... There's a lot of buttons here that I don't really know what they do, but... Maybe they don't do anything. Maybe they're just decoys, right? This, this takes some... This takes some... 48 minutes left. Why doesn't the time reset? Why doesn't the time reset? What a... Can I just... What was it? Control R? Reset the whole thing. Level 1. 
60 minutes left. Okay. Okay. Look, look, we got our time back. If we're restarting from the very start, we might as well. Okay. Now let's try get the sword and fight the guy. Right? Get the sword, fight the guy. It sounds so simple. Let's not fall. Okay. So you really have to press that sooner than you think. Oh, does it not... Once you press it... Oh, it keeps going, okay. Okay, climb up, okay. Run across. Yes, yes, okay, we're doing it. Yep, fall there, okay. Guys, guys, we're getting good. We're getting good at the game. Grab the sword. Yes, okay, okay. <sighs> My hands are sweaty, jeez. Now, we're gonna go up to the guy which we're supposed to kill, and we're probably gonna die. Can someone please explain to me how, how combat works? So I have to... No, 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 why do I... I'm supposed to hold shift there, right? I'm supposed to hold shift, right? 59 minutes left. Why? Parry thrust, that, that's all the... No! Look, control R, okay. I hold shift there, right? And it should hold on to the edge as I jump. Drop down, release, okay. So we're getting we're getting pretty okay going left. We're getting okay going left, but we now need to go going right as well. Okay, so as soon as the button is pressed, we don't have to stand on it. Okay, just to fold there. Okay. Jump across, okay, pull yourself up, okay. Those buttons must be for something, right? Yes, okay. Okay, don't fall. Okay. So, going back right here is a bit of the difficult part. Pick up the button. Okay. Just press shift to damage him. Also, you can use up to defend yourself. If you press down, then you're replacing your sword. And you have to press shift again to take it out. So, don't press down. It puts your sword away. Shift plus one equals parry. Look, I'm using the arrow keys. What is... What is shift plus one? Are you using the, the Apple controls? Okay, so this... Guys. I have to jump to the right and hold shift, right? To grab the ledge, is that correct? Is that correct? Hold shift as I jump? Yes? Shift plus one equals parry. Shift equals attack. So shift up is, okay. Move to the edge first. Oh, so I sneak up to the edge and then I just jump immediately and hold shift and hope against all hopes. Press, look, I'm using the arrow keys, press nine. <sighs> guys, guys, we did it. We beat Prince of Persia. Okay. Let's not die carelessly. Where are we going? We're going up, right? Okay. Don't fall here either. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Let's not walk off the cliff. Turn around. Climb up. Okay, we're going to the right. All right, guys, guys, it's combat time. Shift, shift up, don't press down, right? So we have to parry his attacks. <laughs> Maybe try the controls. You, you can't pull out your sword, right? There's no way to pull out. Why is sticky keys on? I disabled that, okay. That's, that might be a bit of a problem. Okay. Will I, will I beat this guy on my first try? This guy's the easiest to kill? Look. <laughs> We've died to little cliffs. Okay. Why? What? No, I didn't even press it. That many times. Disable... Okay, wait, guys. I'm gonna... I killed him. I killed him. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Allow the... Sh no, turn that... Talk Just turn off everything. No, no more sticky keys. What are toggle keys? Windows 10. Look, I disabled sticky keys ages ago. Okay, we're back. Is sticky keys off? Okay, good. Ah, <sighs> we killed him, but I didn't get to practice my parry. Okay, well. Oh. I'm not sure if I ever beat that guy. I don't remember this door at all. Guys, any secrets? There's a little ledge there. I guess not, right? Oh, that's that's the button. I have never been this far. I played this game quite extensively as a kid. And I don't think I ever got past the first guy. Look, I must have been like four years old. How do I go in? Whoa. Guys! Guys, we beat Prince of Persia. Mm, play that music. It only took us 25 minutes. Look, we've, we've saved the princess. Game over. GG. That's it. <laughs> uh, level 2. Okay, here we go. 54 minutes left. No, no, why? Why would you... Immediately, there's a guy we need to kill. That's so annoying. Okay. How do I... I, I still don't know how to parry. I, I don't understand. What's the button sequence for parrying? I killed him, but... I don't... Ooh. So is that a restore health, or is it a max health increase? I can't remember. Can someone tell me? Is, is this a max health increase or a restore health? It's probably just a restore health, right? Parry is shift plus up. Okay. We cannot see it, we're covering it. Oh, are there two different potions? It's that one. If you step forward enough, you wind up switching places and the bad guys, and you can make them fall into pits. Really? You can, like, swap positions? Okay. It's probably a trap. 
Yeah, that looks like a trap, right? Okay, no, whatever, I'm leaving it. So we can sneak over spikes. I hope that remains true. I'm gonna s just go up first. Okay, oh. Okay, we need to jump over there. Let's get a running start and try not to die. Hold shift, right? Okay. No, oh, okay, okay. It gives us some leeway, <laughs> it gives us some leeway. Wait, we can jump up here. Okay. The game is not that cruel. I don't... Just get a running start. Oh, we made it. Okay, can we jump up? Okay, okay, jump up again. That must be a hint over there, All right? So just shift versus up. Okay, it's parry. Got him. Got him. I assume we're heading in the right direction. Do we go up or down? I see a button on the floor. We gotta jump over that. Hmm. Just go left. These guys are go left. Look, there's two lefts. Let's just avoid that button, shall we? Oh! He's wearing gold. He looks pretty tough. He's got orange health bars. Okay. Okay. Don't come close. Get away from me. Die. Yeah, who said this game was hard? This game's easy. It's so easy. Look, 50 minutes left. Only 10 minutes has passed. <laughs> uh, well, so far, so far, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Blue. Oh, so I see like a spike there. Is that a trap? What is that? Okay, I'm just gonna try grab one of these. Okay, it is restore health. That's a gate, can I just run through? What's the blue one for though? It isn't a trap, okay. Okay, it's kind of a trap. What's, what's the blue one do? I guess we just drink it, right? Oh. What a, what a mean game. What a mean game. Jordan Mechner, what a, what a mean game. Oh, and what is this? We have to jump over to him and fight him? I should have associated the colors. It's a blue potion. These guys often have blue health. Blue is bad. I am red. What is this? Okay, well, I probably should get a bit of a running start to make sure I don't mess up too much. And I just jump over. Ah, come on! Okay, the fighting is fine, but it made you jump like that. Ah! Pink equals health, large vials equals health boost, everything else equals death. <laughs> That's probably an insta-death poison, right? Okay, this makes me want to go up, so I'm gonna go up. Don't jump into the ceiling. Okay. And it's so mean, it, it gave you the health potion before... Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Spike trap, spike trap. I can't just jump back down and land on the spikes. How do I get back down from there? 
Do I have to jump all the way to the right onto that the broken? Now I'm sort of covering it a bit, but do I have to jump all the way over to here to get back down? No quick save? No, no, no. Step, turn, jump, climb. Yeah, getting up, I can. Getting down? Hang. Can I just drop back down? Lower yourself slowly? And that's safe. Lower down, drop, you won't get impaled. Okay. That is so unnerving. Oh, I thought those things were going to fall. So does this restore all health? Yes! Okay. Let's go slow. I can go to the right, but... Don't fall down. Don't fall down. Hang down. And this is safe? Okay. Oh. Revealing secrets. Okay. Okay. Hang down. Okay. So then I guess we just keep going left, right? We started on the right side and we couldn't go right. So there's only one way. I'm so scared to just run through. Okay, that's more spikes. That's okay. Okay. So we have to just run and jump. Jump up. Can we jump up again? You totally can. Of course you can. Now this must be a lie, right? It can't be this easy. Maybe it is. No, it's never that easy. This guy's purple. But we do have four health now. Can we do it? Ah, ah damn it. Got him. Oh, purple guy. First guy to get a legit hit on me. How many levels are there, by the way? So how do we open this? Is that the button? Can I make that jump? I must be able to, right? <sighs> 12 levels? Jeez. Okay. Let's hope we don't die. Let's hope we don't die. Okay. Can I go left anymore? Okay, that's... No, 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 no! Gah! We were so close! So Why did he? No, he was supposed to run a little bit. Really? Can you even rush through this stuff? Come on, die. Okay. Yes. Okay. So we don't need that. We just need to sneak past this. Oh, you can't... That's so mean. 
So then we want to go up here. Right? This is the way I went? Yes. Okay, jump up. I get the feeling you have to just trial and error a lot until you learn how this game works. Okay. Then we keep going. Okay. Okay. Got him. Ignore all of this. Climb up. Ah, it's this guy. That's so unfair. Got it. Ooh, that was close. He almost got me again. Okay, so then I want to go up this way to get the max health boost, right? Step carefully, turn around, jump up, head over there, grab that. You know, I feel like I could do this. Yeah, you totally can. Alright, it's not this way though. <laughs> Let's tr drop down, make sure we don't lose any health, okay. Okay. See, once you know the path, things are much quicker. Okay. Then we have to run here. Jump up here. Now, I never went left here. So what is left here? Is this a dead end? You can't climb here, right? Oh. Really? What does that mean? I can climb up here. Okay. So then there's this guy who actually got a legit hit on me, right? Yes! 40 minutes left. After that, you lose the game. Alright, so we have to run this way. Now, guys, running back... Can you... Can you get to, the, like, stand on the edge of this cliff and jump? Because that's always much safer, but does a run and jump actually get you more distance? Can someone tell me if a run and jump actually gets you more distance, or does it not matter? I really want to know. I really want to know. Remember that you can move while fighting by pressing the arrow. It does matter, okay. Run and jump only, okay. We have to run and jump. Let's get a bit of a run up here. Even though I don't think we need it since we only get so far coming back. Oh, you're supposed to land on the this, this floor here, okay. That's where it drops down from. Okay. Let's try to make sure we start running first. Please don't die. No, no, why? Why? Guys, no. Do I do a normal jump coming back? I don't, I don't. Okay. 
I don't... Okay. Jump from the edge on the way back. I guess you... You should land on the... Hmm. Okay. Okay. I think I think I know what you're supposed to do. I think I know what you're supposed to do. Look, I want to beat this level. These blue guys, pretty easy. Okay, okay. Got him. Okay. How far we've come from just trying to figure out how to draw a sword? Yeah. We've, we've learned a lot in a very short amount of time. We've only been streaming for like 44 minutes. So actually, that's, that's a lot of progress. How do you do this? How do you do this? I guess you don't run and jump. Right? You jump from here. Ah. What a cleverly designed bit of level. No, why why did he Shift stop working? You guys could hear me pressing it. What was that? Look, I pressed shift. He should not have gotten away with that. Okay. Just as I was complimenting the level design. Ah. <laughs> uh. So the difficulty of these guys is how fast they swing. You have to hit them when they try to hit you. So the higher difficulty they are, probably the faster they swing. So the window of opportunity is smaller. That's what I'm reading anyway. So jump here. Now oh, come on, don't don't glitch out my shift key. Okay, good. So I want to go up here. Jump up, okay, here we go. Okay, we're finally back here. I mean, with only 35 minutes left, I don't think we can win. Okay. I think that's faster. Okay, okay. 
You realize that I don't advance while fighting? Yeah, um... <laughs> I don't know, I I've worked out a strategy that, that works for me, but... I just don't want to mess with it too much. So, I come back down from here. Turn around. Jump. Okay. Then there's this guy, who's the toughest guy. So their reaction time for parries is faster. And his attack window is smaller. But I'm learning. I'm learning and getting better. Okay. So then we have to do the run and jump here. Please work. And then we step to the edge here. And then we just jump and hold shift and pray. Uh. No, no, get in there. Okay. Okay. Level two done. Apparently there's 12 levels. How do you do 12 levels in an hour? Are some levels really short? Look, 32 minutes left. Okay, we, we can we can still go, but we got two two different directions we can Let's let's go the other way. Yeah, let's go this way. <laughs> uh yeah, let, let's let's go this way. Can I keep going up? Uh yes, love it. Hmm, how interesting. I guess we should head up there. Right? Right? On a perfect run, I could do this game in about 50 minutes. Yapin laid. Ooh. We can do it in 50 minutes. <sighs> okay. What? What? The button must be somewhere else. Okay. Okay, okay. The button must be somewhere else. So I guess we just go here. Okay, we can't parkour up that. By the way, this game is the origins of parkour gameplay. What? A dead end? So we have to go through the jaws of death? Really? Go upstairs and press 9 when you're on the ledge. What is what does what is 9? Oh. Why 9 9 is jump? Good thing there's a health thing here. <laughs> okay. Go to the top of the j dungeon and then run jump to the right. Oh, okay. Since since we'll probably be closing this out within the next 10 minutes. Let, let's follow you guys. The very top of this room. Right, right. Oh, oh, I see. Yes. Look, do you, do you know how it actually tells you a little clue? Look at the top right corner. You see how there's no ceiling piece there? Actually, no, that's just the edge of the... the sorry, that's the edge of this black border here, sorry. No, it, it actually tells you when you go downstairs and... Wait, run jump, right? Leap of faith? Leap of faith? Okay. Okay. Alright, you guys said so. 
Oh no, no! <laughs> I should have known. I should have known. I, I saw I saw the layout. I saw the layout. Look, since we have infinite lives, I'm just gonna just try. What happens if you just? Oh, you can totally just jump right through it. Okay, but yeah, it's it's not that hard. It's not that hard. Press nine. Do do you just jump from the edge? So like here, if I just press 9, oh, 9 guarantees a jump, I see. I've been like pressing right up really quickly. So if I do this, go right to the edge, and just jump with 9. So that works. Okay, okay. So that works. Okay, so I assume 7 does the same thing the other way. Oh, I, I, I... Okay, okay. The door sound panicked me, the door sound panicked me, okay. Look, we, we gotta do it now. Now that we've discovered the secret, we gotta do it. We have to. So that last step is the button. If you wait on the button, the door doesn't close. So we can sort of plan a little bit there. Okay. So nine here. What? No, no. What? Why did nine do that? Why, why did nine do that? Nine is not supposed to do that. Hmm. When you open the door, just press 7 once, then run jump over it. Remember to have shift ready. Just run jump over it? I pressed 8. Did I press 8 by accident? 9. So that turns you around. That jumps. Okay. So get to the edge. Jump. Jump. Turn around. Seven. No. Wait. No. No. It's so precise. It's so precise. Oh, wait. You have to be quick. You can't just sit on the button because the raising time adds to your advantage. Okay. Okay. Look. Look, look I pr I'm pressing 9! I press 9! That was definitely 9. That's... Uh... Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I think to be safe, we turn around first, then press 9. Okay. No, don't jump twice. Turn around. No, okay. Do this, okay. So climb up. Climb up. Climb up, turn around, press 9, walk to the edge, press 9. Press 9, turn around. Oh, okay. No, no, don't! No! Why? Why? Ah, oh, these buttons are so hard! These buttons are so hard! Look, look. <laughs> we found a secret. The secret is very difficult. But we are going to figure this out. So, okay. We're gonna climb up here. Can't remap the keys. This is this is in browser DOSBox. No, I don't think so. So we turn around. Nine to jump. So walk to the edge. Nine to jump. Nine to jump. Turn around. Seven. Grab that. Pull yourself up. 
walk to the edge, seven, and then just run and jump and run. Damn it! <laughs> it's so hard. It's so hard. Is my death count 15? Okay, look. I'm trying. I'm trying so hard. Let's sneak up to the edge. Okay. Jump up. Okay. Okay. That was better. That was better. We actually got back to here and I just died at a silly spot. But I feel like I might have still been a bit too late. So I do this, do this, turn around. I think I can walk to the edge. Seven. S what? I press seven. I press seven. I press seven. What? Sometimes the buttons just don't do what you tell them to do. Okay. 16, huh? 16? Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Turn around. 9. So when I do this, I do this. Turn around. Take a step. 7. Can I... 7? Okay. And then run. Jump. No. Too late. Too late. 23 minutes left. Look, we'll, we'll we'll stop before then, but I I think I'm very close to getting this. I'm very close to getting this. It's so it's so difficult. Uh, it's okay. I'm I'm very close. See, I'm starting to get the pattern down. I'm starting to get the pattern down. Nine. Nine. Turn around. Take a step. Seven. Seven. And then run and jump. And then just keep running. Don't fall down that hole. Jump. Okay. Run right to the edge and jump. Hold shift. Climb up. Okay. We did it. Now, is this actually the way you're supposed to go or is it a secret? I don't know. So if I walk slowly, I don't trigger. Ah, you see that? You see that? I want to jump over that. Okay. Now, is this a button to open this up? I actually missed the secret. What was the secret? <laughs> What was the secret? If, if this isn't the secret, what is the secret? There's another HP further right? Oh, like max HP. Well, we might just die right here. Bet this kills me if I don't. No. Oh, wow. Really? 20 minutes left? Could I actually beat this, this level? That would be pretty awesome. Can I actually beat this level? Oh, the, the teeth stopped? Do I still have to jump through it? That was close. Oh. Wait, it's invincible? Okay. That means I have to swap positions with it. How do I swap positions with it? 
Do I have to push it down? Damn! Did I do it? Did I do it? Is he dead? He's not dead. Damn! We're on our last health. This is the Dark Souls of video games, okay? <laughs> no, no, the shift key didn't work! Wait, why am I here? Did it give me a checkpoint? Did it give me a checkpoint? Really? Wow, I didn't know there were... I didn't know there were... Checkpoints in this game. You need to parry those strikes. Look, I don't know how to parry. And I can envision winning without parrying. Oh, the game isn't as mean as I thought it was. It gave me gave us a checkpoint. Okay. Come on. Okay. okay. Damn. Okay. okay. If I step here and press seven, you'll jump over. Guys, we actually, we actually beat the level. We actually beat the level. I can't believe it. And we just passed an hour of playing this game. We beat level three. She's just lying there. She's just lying there. She's fine. She's fine. Oh. We're actually in the palace. I have never seen this. There's a button right there. Press it. Okay. Let's just run right through. Okay, come on. What a weird looking room. I've just never seen this tile set. Oh. No, we're dead. Okay. No, that that's perfect. That's perfect. Guys, that is going to be the end of my look at Prince of Persia for today. I have learned so much. I've learned so much. And the only thing I don't know how to do right now is parry. But we've made it this far without parrying. So maybe, maybe uh, we don't need parrying. <laughs> 18 deaths. Yeah, that's a sound effect. Oh, if you don't... If you don't restart, 
you just, they just, it sends you back to the main menu. Wow, okay. Parry's up arrow. Yeah, I know how to do it. I've just never done it successfully. But guys, guys, this has been Jordan Mechner's Prince of Persia in DOS. Probably the first PC game I ever played. And I hope you enjoyed it. Tandersia, Clerken, Kerchok, Lapin Laid, Shud God, Mask of the Red Death, Chaos Fangs, Demand J2X, Alinea G, Lord Nestor, the Balky. Thank you all so much, SG Barista. And also thank you, Chaos Fangs, for dropping what a total of 3,000 plus bits today. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you. Well, actually, if you want to see more Abandonware Adventures, if you're watching on YouTube, click the buttons on the screen right now. Check out the whole Abandonware Adventures playlist, but until next time, ooh, the evil Jafar, I will see you in the next video. Bye!